da. Ja, hi. Und willkommen. Mein Name ist dann die LP und ich begrüße euch zurück zu Kingdom Hearts 3. Remind. Ne, da begrüße ich euch hier zum ersten Mal. Ne? Ähm, vor einer Woche ungefähr ist das DLC für Kingdom Hearts 3 rausgekommen. Remind. Und ein paar neue Inhalte wurden hinzugefügt zu diesem Spiel. Und ich freue mich natürlich, dass ich wieder das Spiel auspacken kann und mich wieder ergötzen kann an Kingdom Hearts. Oh, ähm, ich habe in der letzten Folge noch so ganz kurz ähm, die Platin Trophäe geholt, habe sehr nord mit der Ultima Klinge besiegt, um zu beweisen, dass die Ultima Klinge stärker ist als die Chi Klinge. Ja, und ja, habe Level 99 erreicht natürlich. Und jetzt können wir, glaube ich, wenn wir hier hingehen oder hier, können wir Remind starten. So, Spiele Remind. Und ja, das ist jetzt so meine Frage, ne? mit was für einem Spielstand gehen wir jetzt hier ein? Ich würde ja schon fast sagen, wir gehen mit unseren Level 53er Spielstand hier rein, ne? weil ich nicht weiß, was die Level Voraussetzungen für... Warte mal, in drei Stunden habe ich Level 99, da kann doch gar nicht stimmen. Hm? Da kann auch irgendwie nicht stimmen. Ich habe noch nicht drei Stunden gebraucht, um Level 99 zu erreichen. Was, wie ist das denn passiert? Keine Ahnung. Ähm, ja, ich würde sagen, wir gehen dann einfach mit einem von diesen beiden Spielstellen, den ich gemacht habe, nachdem ich das Spiel durchgespielt habe beim ersten Mal. Und jetzt Level 53 wird ja wohl stark genug sein. Ne? Ich glaube, da haben wir noch nicht Ultima und so. Da haben wir definitiv noch nicht Ultima. Und ja, wenn ich sehe, dass DLC ist doch sehr knüppelhart, dann holen wir unseren Level 99er Spielstand, wo wir alles haben. Und ja, aber ich würde sagen, wir gehen mit diesem Spielstand hier rein und Zeichen des Versprechens. Okay, ich scheine schon alle Glücksembleme zu diesem Punkt zu haben, gesammelt zu haben. Gut, ist auch nicht schlecht, ne? So, ich weiß jetzt nicht genau, wann das DLC eigentlich gesagt spielt. Ich habe mich relativ von Spoilern irgendwie so zurückgezogen. Ich wollte mir die Überraschung nicht verderben und deswegen weiß ich nicht so genau, was jetzt noch alles auf mich zukommt. Ich weiß, dass wir gegen einige Bosse, gegen neue Bosse kämpfen können und so und das eine zusätzliche Story jetzt noch gibt und so, aber mehr weiß ich jetzt auch nicht. Also ja, ein kleiner Traum in der Hoffnung, nie wieder voneinander getrennt zu sein. Da wir das Bild sehen, nehme ich jetzt mal schon an, dieses DLC spielt nach dem Ending. Also Mogi zeichnet als Versprechen gegen Sterntreu tauschen, ja. Und da. Und da sehen wir schon direkt Best Character. May your heart be your guiding key. Picture this. Huh? A black goat stashes away a letter, then orders a white goat to search for it. What could his intention das der nicht possibly glaube? be? Nee, schade. Great, a riddle, just what I need. There are many possibilities. Perhaps he forgot where it's hidden. Or he's playing a prank. Or the letter has truly gone missing. I can think of several reasons offhand. Guessing is simply useless. Well, Then just follow your orders, plain and simple. Yes, that's what I've always done. I follow the orders from above, without question. However, I sometimes can't help but read into my opponent's strategy. <laughs> Too long on the job? If the contents of the box are so unknown, Why is it of such critical importance to the organization? Furthermore, was it Xehanort or Xemnas who gave the order? Well, it's tricky. Ich weiß, wer es war. All Xehanort yeah. cares about is the clash between the Seven Lights and Thirteen Darkness. Wir haben schon das Secret Ending gesehen und so. It's unlikely he would hold such an interest in this mysterious box. Which means, the order was issued by Xemnas, or the one who informed me of my task, you. As if it must have been Xemnas. My inquiries suggested otherwise. 
Oh, man. You asked him. What are your intentions? Look, I don't know what's inside the box, but it's been protected by Keyblade wielders since way back when. Aren't you curious? I heard it contains information that's vital to all Keyblade wielders. Secrets. Ich hoffe, wir finden mal endlich raus, was da drin ist. Da wurde das ganze Spiel lang hier rüber geteased, ey. I don't remember. I keep my eyes and ears wide open, but I've traveled so many different places. It's hard to keep everything straight, you know. If this box is truly as important as you say, why now? I believe you discovered that others also seek it. And you need to find it before anyone else does. In order to keep your connection to the box a secret from those around you. <laughs> Zigba, who are you really? Here. <laughs> no matter. It doesn't make a difference to me. It's all the same. I'm content to feign ignorance. I've had back off an attack. Question is, who are you, Lutzard? I mean, we still have Isaac by us, ne? Oh, yeah, that's after the ending. Oh, that that was. Na klar war das vor dem Ending. War die eine Szene mit Malefiz und Carlo. It's finally over. Hm. Hey. No. We'll find Kairi. Let's head back to Master Yen Sid. We can figure it out. No. I know what to do. Sora. My whole journey began the day I lost her. And every time I find her, she slips away again. I thought we'd finally be together, but she's out there, alone. Not for one more second. That's right. Thank you, Donald, Goofy. But this time, I have to go it alone. Sora, listen. The power of waking isn't to go chase hearts around. Even if you do locate Kairi, you might never come home to us again. I will. And we'll both be back before you know it. Please. Let him go, Mickey. His heart and his mind are made up. Now believe in him. Yeah. Safe journey, Sora. Thank you. Oh, and I'll waren wir doch irgendwo stehen geblieben mehr oder weniger dann hat man das ending gesehen und dann hat man so ungefähr gesehen was mit so passiert ist und ja jetzt fängt das dlc an alles klar bin ich mal gespannt was jetzt passiert und da sitzt jemand von der organisation So? Yeah. It wards off darkness. It's useful. Told ya. And so, how'd it go? The tour. 
Okay. I learned the reason for my existence. At no, at no oh, I know. Tell me more. All around the world, people live seemingly peaceful lives. They believe themselves to be moral and virtuous, but it's all an act. Darkness lurks in the pit of everyone's heart. Their light is a total farce. Sounds like your trip around the world opened your eyes, but you got a little bit more than you anticipated. You must have seen a lot of darkness. Those who are weak, and who desire greater power, simply strip the strong of their power and convince themselves they've earned it. That's how people become tainted by darkness. They believe what they want to believe, using hollow reasons as justification. They repeat this cycle, and their darkness grows. So you're saying the weak feel the need to justify their actions to maintain a sense of self. Can't let that slide? No. It's better they be ruled by darkness. People carry delusions of having power, but it's a lie. They are but sheep pretending to be wolves. Though I admit, I can understand why. Oh, never heard that one before. A Keyblade wielder willing to side with the darkness? Why not just let them be until the darkness consumes them? Because left alone, the world would fall to chaos. There needs to be order. You sure about that? Why not just sit back and watch it play out? Understanding hearts is difficult. More so the emotions within. I simply realize that it's easy to dismiss what you don't comprehend. All right, all right. The world needs you. I'll grant you that one. I don't know what I can do, but I will act. What comes next is too important. I suppose letting false light dictate the future might be a pretty lousy move. So, you can make a change. You have that power. What do you want for the world? Power, eh? Who knows? My training's coming to an end, and the exam's not far off. Maybe I can gain some clarity then. You're letting the exam decide? Listen to me. The results don't matter. You believe the world needs you. Sounds like you already know where you're headed. <sighs> it's funny. Somehow. I can sense where I'm supposed to go, and what I'm supposed to do. Yes, even this coat, there's something familiar about it, as if I'm meant to wear this. Hmm. No, you'll ditch it soon. What Duh. do you mean? I mean that one day you're going to outgrow it. How so? If you truly possess great power, the darkness can't control you. You won't need a silly old coat to stay safe. In fact, you'll be the one controlling the darkness instead. Me, on the other hand, I'm too much of a scaredy cat to ever take mine off. Why would anyone tell me to do Are you really some kind of fortune teller? Hmm. Well, I could lie and tell you that's what I am when I'm actually a brilliant artist or even a scholar. I could tell you that I dream of world peace when I'm actually planning for its destruction. The truth is what you see with your eyes, not what you hear. So, your name? What did I just... Never mind. 
I guess there's no harm. My name is. Yeah, totally. I'm a lost master. Lost master? May your heart be your guiding key. Außer er ist es nicht. Er hat doch gerade gesagt, er könnte sagen, er war das, aber in Wirklichkeit ist er das. 75 Jahre später. Mein Gott, so alt ist sie ja noch schon. But so funny, old man. Mind sharing with us? I stand here today because of a fated encounter. Very many years ago, when I was still a young lad. I never learned who he was, and perhaps I never will. But I see now the truth he spoke of. <sighs> we don't have time for bedtime stories. Without the kid, we're still down a 13th vessel. And as for the other 12, only three of us are here right now. Are you absolutely sure the others made their way back to their respective times? That's like enough dream drop distance. Your shit is all over the place. <laughs> Marluxia and Larxene are both here in this time, attempting to locate the new Seven Hearts. Luxerd is also somewhere about in this age, but after our last meeting, he went in search of something per your order. Isn't that so? Huh. Oh, that. Right. Well, let's just say that what he's doing will benefit us in the long run. But it's really of no importance right this second. Go on. Playing your cards close as usual. Hm. All right. The hearts of Ansem, Semnus, Benitas, Riku Replica, and young Xehanort returned to where they came from and reassembled once more. Each of them is seeking a guardian of light. So, the ones who turn human and then back again into nobodies are me, you, Luxord, Marluxia, and Larxene. That's five. The ones from the past transferred into replicas are Ansem, Xemnas, Vanitas, Riku Replica, and the old man's younger self. Then we add the old man in. The total comes up to 11. I think we're still missing two. Now we must discuss why we have assembled here today. My incarnations from past times, vessels into which I transferred my heart, my essence, were destroyed. Thus I was restored to what you see now. Naja, und Terra Nord, genau. completely disappear. Their heart and body must be restored to their original form. That is one reason why I distributed my heart into several vessels. Ansem and Temnis originated from Terra, or rather his young form, and it too was restored. However, my heart has returned to me, while his is yet lost. I decided to fill this hollow vessel with my heart. Indeed, the very same heart had previously resided within young Terra. 
So that makes 12. No, and she on. Who do we get to replace the kid? 20 replicas were created by Vexen. The first 12 were nothing more than puppets, barely human. The prototype model was the Riku replica, and then number I was made. That leaves us with six. Ansem, Xemnas, Venitas, Riku replica, and young Xehanort's hearts. Five vessels, one left. Vexen and Demix are candidates, but backups at best. The plan for the last replica is to give it a heart that is connected to Sora's. Connected to Sora? Anyone in mind? The second prototype that was created, number I. Though erased from memory, it remained in Vexen's records. Its existence is greatly linked to Sora's memories, and thus should prove to be more than adequate for our needs. Number I. An imaginary number. How fitting. While young Xehanort is occupied with transferring hearts, I must go fulfill my duty. I will go and retrieve Vexen. Reliable as always. It sounds to me like you've got everything dependably under control. Well, I'm off to do my part. Wir fahren jetzt mehr oder weniger nur, was schon in Kingdom Hearts 3 alles passiert ist, ey. As we agreed upon. Also, vor allem das sind irgendwie die meisten Sachen davon sind alles schon Sachen, die ich persönlich schon wusste. Ich meine die Szene mit hier dem Meister und mit sehr Nord, mit den jungen sehr Nord, das war das einzige, was jetzt neu ist, glaube ich. Also sind jetzt Sachen, die jetzt so ein Hardcore Kingdom Hearts Fan schon alles irgendwie wusste, dass die alle passiert sind. Aber okay. Wir haben jetzt 20 Minuten, bis jetzt noch gar kein Gameplay. <lacht> Und wenn wir gerade von Gameplay reden. Oh, du schon wieder. Charity. Back so soon? What's wrong? Ja, schon wieder tot. Well, mehr oder weniger. Even with the power of waking, you can't just bring someone back. But Kyrie's heart hasn't been lost yet. She's still with us, right? Maybe, but this time, I'm afraid the situation is a lot worse. Hey, I've already restored six hearts. What's one more? But that's not how it's supposed to work at all. The power of waking is meant to be used to wake and restore sleeping hearts, not to restore them after they've completely faded away from existence. You've done that six times before, and as a result, you've managed to greatly alter the course of history itself. You've broken a nature taboo. Nature... A forbidden act. Break a taboo of nature, and you'll end up paying an extraordinary price. Oh. Ah, jetzt kommt das wieder. I've heard that before. So, what's the price? You'll Der lose Tod. your powers. You won't be able to use the power of waking. That's all? No problem. But that's not all. You yourself will vanish from this world. And without your powers, you can't return to the world you came from. I don't care. What? There's a lot I don't understand. But I know that this is all I can do right now. 
I have to do everything I can to get Kyrie back. That's the whole reason behind my journey. <sighs> I can't stop you, can I? Kann ich theoretisch jemand anders die Macht des Erwachens einfach benutzen, um Sora wieder zurückzuholen dann? Then this really is goodbye. So listen carefully to me. Hm. Ich habe wahrscheinlich schon wieder nicht richtig aufpasst. But you won't be able to rewrite it this time. No matter what happens, you have to accept it and move on. Oh. Okay, dann würde ich sagen, nachher sind die ganzen Fähigkeiten hier. Ja, müssen wir jetzt nicht unbedingt haben. Warten auf Eden. Obwohl, ich würde schon gerne sehen. Also, warum nicht? Hm. Was brauche ich denn so nicht? Ne? Das ist jetzt meine Frage. Die Auto das ist aber nur ein Punkt. Ja, okay, komm. Ja, wie sieht es denn hier aus? Habe ich jetzt irgendwie so neue Sachen hier? Nö. Ich hatte schon alles. Ich hatte schon alles zu diesem Zeitpunkt. Das geht doch irgendwie gar nicht. Ich verstehe nicht, wie das irgendwie funktioniert. Egal. Okay, warte mal. Dann würde ich ja sagen, ich mache jetzt hier einen Schnitt. Wir haben jetzt nicht viel irgendwie gemacht. Wir haben eigentlich gar nichts bisher gemacht. Wir haben jetzt nur Katzdienst die ganze Zeit geguckt. Und ja, würde ich sagen, was dann für diese Folge. Ja, sieht auch normal aus. Und ja, in dem Sinne sage ich dann Dankeschön fürs Zuschauen. Ich hoffe, euch hat der Part trotzdem gefallen, auch wenn jetzt nicht viel passiert ist. Und wir sehen uns dann in der nächsten Folge wieder. Ciao, ciao.